Hello everyone, welcome, welcome in. Welcome to Starship Troopers Terran Command. This is a demo of a game that's coming out, I think it's in March next year. And for those of you who are of my age, in their early 30s, <coughs> you, will, you may remember a game called Starship Troopers Terran Ascendancy, um, which I can't say for absolute certain, but this feels very much like a sort of spiritual successor to that game. So we're going to jump in. Um, I saw this. It's not like there's any options. Oh, there we go. Video. Let's get it out. Is that literally the only the only options there is? Uh, okay, I guess so. There's literally no other graphics options. I mean, I guess it is just a demo, isn't it? Okay, well, we'll just roll with it. So, yeah, I've seen a video online. That is all I've seen of this uh, of this game. So we're going to do the... What's the video? Please let it be, like, in the style of... Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's in the style of Starship Troopers. If you haven't seen the film, go and watch it. It's an absolute Starship cult classic. Starship Troopers Terran Command is a real-time strategy game set in the universe of the Starship Troopers films. In this video, we will take a look at how to play Peace of Mind, one of the available scenarios in the demo. I'm not actually sure I need to see this. I think I think we can probably work this out, can't we? We're going to do... So what's that? Difficulty 3... Oh, we know we can select it. Okay. Uh, weapon damage modifier. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just roll with a normal difficulty. And let's see what happens, shall we? The Battle shall we? of Klendathu. A day that will live in infamy. But from tragedy springs hope as the Federation rebuilds its fleet bigger and stronger than before. To fuel this war machine, all eyes are now on Kualasha. Once an isolated outpost, this mineral-rich world has become a key part of humanity's battle for survival. But the planet's vital are. mining the industry Arachnids. may now be in danger after reports of bugs on the surface. And so the mobile infantry answers humanity's call. These brave men and women will defend Quilasha from any insect aggression. Uh, okay, there's not, is anything else to do there, so... To war! Listen up, Lieutenant. Here we are. Team kicked in that hill. Now they got more bugs than they know so it do. is important to remember this is only a demo. The game doesn't come out until March, I believe. Let's do this by the book. Don't be a hero, and you won't need a body bag. You understand me? Let's go on the bounce. What was the name of the the troops or the uh, the sort of clan? Oh, it was Roughnecks, wasn't it? Recalls Roughnecks. That was it. That was it. I remember now. Right, we got combat engineers. They don't like they're controlled by us. It looks like we're just controlling these boys. Uh, oh wow, we're using. No, we use We can't use directional keys to uh, to navigate around the map. Surely, surely not. Where's controls? It wants to use. All oh, right, so we can navigate grids by using. That's really odd. Okay, all right. Well, we'll roll with the keys then. Okay, right, let's go. So what buttons we got down here? So we've got grenades, we have attack move, stop, hold fire, etc, etc, okay. How far can we zoom in? It looks okay, actually, doesn't it? Not bad at all. I suspect this won't be the full, what the game will look like on release, but I don't think it'll be that far away. I think it looks pretty good when you zoom right in. So it looks like, despite the fact that I've moved it to... 144 hertz. I'm not actually sure. I think it seems to be locked at 60, but for an RTS, that doesn't really matter. Okay, so can we? So we can rotate round if I hold triangle down. Advanced team located the bug hole. Hope they say something for us. Okay, so we can do that. I think line of fire is quite this important is in this. To get clear lines of fire. Yeah, so I don't think they will, the troops will fire if um. I don't want to get too close. Don't think they'll fire if there's friendlies in the way. Let's 
So there's a little bit of a uh, little bit of strategy here. Let's move forward. Wants us to move forward. Nicely done. Striking coming. I do hope the game plays on the fact. I mean, anybody that's seen the movie will know that the odds were just insurmountable. Oh, hello! Nice little bombing run. Fly boys are pretty useful sometimes. Boom. Um, yeah, I don't. I do hope that the game plays on the fact that you have these insurmountable odds. I want these epic battles where there's just like hundreds and hundreds or thousands of thousands, depending on how good the game is. I want the the battles to be that epic. All right, let's pursue these arachnids. Are they luring us into a trap? What kind of half-ass containment operation is this? Okay, we're going this way now, apparently. So the game looks like, every time you hold your mouse here, it looks like it's trying to put your troops in a position. It looks like they're, they're murdering people as they go through. Right, pursue these fuckers. Damn it. Either these civilians ignored the evac order, or someone's getting the weapons back in base for missing these stragglers. Oh, we lost one. Alright. Okay, what's Sir, going on here? Major Cortez reporting. Orders from command require you to confiscate all civilian weapons. Cortez. Why do I recognize that Good name from the movies? Voice. That wasn't Denise Richards' well, character, was it? Those weapons, I, I, I can't remember. It's been so long since I've seen the movie. Right, do we do we click a button to capture? Oh no, there's a little yellow bar. I see it. Right, okay. Goodly done. Right now, what? Where are we going now, chaps? Oh, there's more ammo stashes. Is there? Uh, I, there's none there that I've missed, is there? Okay, let's follow the road round. I guess doing it bit by bit is important. We don't want to get Sounds ambushed. Like company's in trouble. Let's lend them a hand. Oh, that flamethrower! They don't, they don't appear to need a great deal of help. <laughs> They got two flamethrowers. They don't need my help. Okay, but so far, this is quite similar to what I remember. I mean, it was a long time. I think Terran Ascendancy was early 2000s when it came out. Oh, they've given me these guys. Nice. Um, so it's difficult to really remember with total clarity exactly how that game played. But it was an RTS game. Um, I do remember that. Radio station's just ahead. Move it to range and get fleet on the horn. Finally. We can break through this goddamn interference. Okay. These guys not got a line of fire. I guess this little symbol here means they don't have a good line of fire. So it does literally look like one shot, one kill. So what are they being blocked by? Not sure why they were being blocked there. Maybe a little glitch. Right, you guys go there. Okay, so actually moving in a slightly more tactical way 
and a little bit slower does seem to be pretty important. We've lost a few men there. They're, they're, they're a bit light. They're in the yellow. Right, so let's do this properly. Let's set up some defensive positions here. These apes have taken a licking. Use the radio station to call a fleet and get replacements for our casualties. Uh, okay, so how do we do that? Select a unit's call reinforcements. Is that just because we're near a radio station? Request reinforcements. Nice. Doesn't appear to cost... Oh, we've got supplies here. War support. Okay, so we do have some form of resource system in the game. 13 out of 10. So I suspect that is going to be what our reinforcements are... Uh, Oh, here we go. Major bug movement. That's what we want to okay. see. Things are about to get interesting. Look sharp, people. Form a perimeter. Okay, so. We've got 30 seconds. Um, okay, so let's put you there. Don't really have can't really put the flamethrower people behind. That doesn't really... It's not really going to work, is it? Okay. They, come? they can be Watch like a last... Last resort. Depends, I guess, on how many we're going to get. But these guys are useless because they're not going to shoot through these, are they? In fact, neither of them can, can actually shoot. Right, you go around there. Wow, there's quite a lot of them, isn't there? Okay, we might be in trouble. <laughs> we might be in trouble here. Oh, hang on. Grenades. Grenades. We've got grenades, haven't we? Grenades. Quick, can we get get that grenade out? Oh, we did. That's huge. Oh, that's just that really just saved us. One dude left in that company. Alright, we took we took casualties there. Do they replace? It replaces the entire unit. Nice. New order, sir. Bug activity is too strong. Command is recalling you to Delta Four Base. Leave the civvies and get yourself home. Hmm. That route won't be pretty. Rough terrain. Lots of hidey holes for bugs. But you gotta punch through. Okay, but good start. I said I wanted to see the sort of overwhelming number of bugs attacking you. So that's a a good start for the first mission that we played. So is, that, is this costing supplies when I do this? No, it's not. Interesting. So does anybody else need returning to full strength? No, everybody else is good. Right, let's get cracking then, shall we? Why is their line of fire all blocked? Like, I think there's a little bit of a, a bug here. <laughs> Pardon the pun. I think that it's it seems to be um, over over exaggerating the where these lines of fire are because it, they're far enough to the left in my opinion that they shouldn't be in the way but it seems to continue to suggest that they will be which is a bit frustrating okay right so that's all the ammo stashes. So now I guess we're just making our way over here then. This. This is an ambush or a defensive position if ever I've seen one. So hopefully once we get over there we'll have a nice little juicy battle. Right. Let's get on the move, shall we? So let's get you there. Let's get you there. Let's push you over there. Welcome to Delta 4. Now haul ass. Oh, we've got some... Those walls. We've got some uh, friendlies. So we should be alright to just move then. We got, we've got a radio unit in there so we can replenish units. 100% we've got to be, do some defending here. Bugs are going for the base. Yep. Standard procedure is to keep the gates shut until there are zero hostile in the area. Oh, hell. Why can't they just open the gates quick? At least there'll be a target rich environment. Right, where are they coming from? Oh, 
and get a cheeky grenade in there. Okay, good start. Now they're coming from the other side. Those guys, those guys are completely stuck. Battle's over. Open up. Oh. oh, that was rubbish. I wanted, definitely wanted a bigger battle than that. But it's, it fe definitely feels like the movie, though, which is good. They've, they've definitely stayed true to the movie here. Get on those walls and get ready. Get on the walls, okay, right. You go over there. All right, you apes. Show those bugs what you're made of. Oh, we've got flying jobbies as well. So we're not controlling half of these. So we're, we're only seem to be covering this part of it. Do we need to worry about covering somewhere else? I guess there's a bit of a gap in the wall there. Okay, this is quite a serious gap in the wall, actually. Let's go there. Okay, a cheeky grenade over there. Probably going to kill all my all my uh, fellow friendlies over there with that grenade. I feel like it needs to happen. Okay. Well, they got in, but they didn't get very far. Any wounded? Head to the medic. Everyone else, go find yourself a drink. Nice. There we go. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. 